welcome. <laughs> What's your last name? I need your ID, please. Oh. Included international. Uh, I am here. Oh, this is such a bad lighting. Nice. I am here. <gasps> yes. <gasps> oh, it's so pretty. Dun, 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 dun. What's up? Ah! Yo. Oh well. So I'll do a room tour, Royal Hotel room tour, level twenty-eight. <laughs> so there's um closet where I put my um jacket in just then. But I'm so glad that they have the whole hair dryer and the iron. So, Cause I was gonna bring the dryer and it would have um way more and I would have had to do baggage claim which I didn't want to do there's LG TV um, air condition chair um, I mean the desk and they give us this like water thingy there's a um, mirror hello full body mirror I'll go back Um, the thing I liked about what well, I saw it on YouTube was um, this mirror, which makes you look like an actual YouTube professional vlogger. Uh, and then there's like a tub and the towel, everything. Yes. Yes. So on the flight, since it's end of January, no one's here. Like, they all come to watch the ball drop around 1st of January and then they just go home. So we had the luxury of lying down on the whole chair, like the economy seats. It was like half empty. So I didn't, they don't need business seats because everyone was like lying down on like the three, like the one row each. So I was like <laughs> sleeping and eating and enjoying my life the whole time on the plane um legs stretched up with my um, blanket on and then just slept yeah it was amazing so i was expecting like the the worst with the flight because it's like what how many like 15 hours on uh, uh, sydney to la and la to new york it was like four four and a half so I was like, my skin's gonna dry out, I'm gonna be hella bloated. Which didn't happen from Sydney to LA, which I was really surprised of because I get bloated really easily. But from um, the LA to New York, it was pretty bad because I don't know what it is. I I caught um, Qantas flight, Qantas flight for both of them. But Sydney one, it was amazing. But the food was like mediocre. But New York, like when I caught the flight in you in the US, the food was amazing. <laughs> so I couldn't stop eating. Um, the meatloaf, um, potato smash, potato smash. <laughs> uh, yeah, smash potato and like cheesecake, chocolate and raspberry cheesecake. But they were all amazing. So I was just like. <sighs> Yeah, and just like I lost my mind, I guess. So, and I was um switching from air train to the L I R R, so Long Island Railroad. Um, this guy came, and then he was like, "Oh, my my mother's uh, sick, 
and needs a pharmaceutical. Like he's trying to say he needs money for his mom's medication, but then, well, he might actually need one. But because um, I've seen so many videos like that, I was like, oh, sorry, I need to go. Um, yeah, and it smells so bad. Like the thing is, yeah, it just smells really like piss and fart everywhere. Um, that's why I'm kind of confused. When I was walking from the Penn Station to here, this guy was like, yeah, that was an um, interesting encounter. I'm gonna head to the Hershey's Chocolate World. So I planned this all out. Day one, it will be 42nd Street. That's the world's famous street, like they said. <laughs> so it has like Broadway, um, like it's all vibrant and all bright. So I'm gonna walk past there because my hotel's on 44 to 45th, I think. So I'll go past there, uh, go to 7th Avenue, and then go um, straight up, which is Times Square. So I go to Times Square. There's a lot of scammers there, so go to Times Square and then uh, walk around the Disney store, M&M store. No, no. Disney Store, Hershey's World, and then M&M Store. I think I'm gonna be really overwhelmed when I see that. It's like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory in real life. So yeah. Yes. Bye.